I know there's no real intro to this all or nothing Electric Garden City Eagles fantastic drama Amazon special Netflix Disney Plus I just forgot how much effort goes into all this editing but I'm working on them contracts don't you worry it's going to be prime time TV it's here it's now it's game day another own game third one on the bands as we host Northampton Owen Chenox who make the hour and five minute drive down the A428 to Pixmore playing fields where it's Letchworth Rift Garden City Eagles v Northampton Owen Chenox I literally just said that so who's old enough to remember when Man United binned off that grey kit, classing it as unlucky when they lost to Southampton? Was never seen ever again. Well, that's what we've now done with our kit we wore last week. Not only was we wearing our new away kit, was wearing our new away kit while playing at home as well. But that's now been binned off, never to be seen ever again. So it was the kit that made us lose. No more green aluminium space kits. Get in the bin, no more losses. <laughs> But anyway, that's another chat in bollocks. Let's get into the football news. So Northampton was relegated last season where they finished 20th, playing 38 times, winning just five, drawing five, losing 28, goals for 30, goals against 96. That's a minus 66 goal difference and they ended on 20 points. They currently sit seventh after one win and one loss. Here are the stats from last season. I don't care about your lens. I don't give a fuck. Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. Same as last week. I don't think we've ever met each other before. But with that all being said, let's get to the ground. Let's get some team news in. Let's get three points. And then let's... Let me get the fuck out of here. Up the Eagles. <laughs> We worked on training all week, taking to this Saturday's game. We go out there today against this lot, which are a team which have come down, which relatively will have experience. So we'll go about our business. The right things are work hard off the ball, work hard when we have the fucking ball. When we haven't got the ball, we retain our shape. We work very hard on the transition of the direction of the ball. Bottom line is now, as you can see, the squad is going to get bigger because if you don't do what we're asking, we'll have to make changes because it's about results. We line up. They can go for it. goalkeeper. Theo Knox, defender. Nicola Rousset, defender. Holly Trot, controller. Sam James, captain. Kane, midfielder. Vlad is just going forward. Ronnie Bates, striker. Mark Summers, striker. On the bench. Harry got him in, midfielder. Cameron Martin, defender. Defender. Right, that's sent it forward. <laughs> Doesn't matter what I show you on here. If you can't pass five yards, we're fucked. If you don't work hard off the ball, and when you win it back, drive at the team, balance the team goes. You cannot turn up like last week and give us that share of shit. Not acceptable. Hey, Matty, what's on to you on the minute? Ten past three, Jinx. Let's go, then. Come on, come on.
question your ability, why question is your desire and passion to win the game when it's not going well? We came out last week, 2 0 down, desire and passion was there, got the penalty, got the free kick, got the tool, we're flying. Let's go, boys. <laughs>
Ball's bouncing around like an hot potato. Number seven will collect. No one can get hold of this ball at the moment. Bobbly pitch, bobbly ball. Mr. Blobby. Anyway, we are back into it with the Romanian Usain Bolt who will play a ball down to Ronnie who's tried to flick that on. That just reminds me of the old Thierry Henry Robert Pires penalty. Shocking. Dempsey will collect that ball again. He's going to get a nosebleed. He's gone past one. He's gone past two. He's gone past... Can he get past the third one? No, nope. number 10 is saying you ain't having none of this, boy. You will not pass and clears the ball down the line to number 90. Chenix are controlling the ball, keeping it nice and tidy. The Lino's getting involved with something. I don't know what's going on here. Number 10 is just like, what's going on, mate? We're trying to play a game of football. I'll tell you what, you're pissing me off. Get out of the way. There you go. That's one way to solve that. Number 9 ducks out the way again. Surprised he didn't jump on the floor. We've cleared our lines with Body Trot. Playing it up here to Summers, who's played a long ball up to Ronnie. What will Ronnie do? Sammy James is in the centre. He's been brought down. He's been brought down. That's another penalty for us. That's our fourth penalty in three games. Odds on we'll get a penalty on Tuesday night. Summers from 12 yards. Keeps going the right way, but he's put it in the back of the net, and we are 3-2 up. Can we hold on to this lead? And with that, the referee calls half time. Football's about relationships, units on the park. Back two haven't played together before. Back four haven't played in this setup before. It takes time to gel. What I need is encouragement. Firstly, fucking well done for your goals. It's fucking sacrilege. You score with a right hook and then you go and take a knockout the other end. You've got to learn to shut it off. Trying to clean the ball 50 fucking yards, you miss kicks it, it's fucking gone through you. Nathan, trying to fuck around, put it in the hole. The work rate is good. You can't run them around up there, fucking on a fucking zip as well. You've worked so hard to get in front, and then you go and fucking shit it up because of the ball over the top. They're 10 in for the last 10 minutes. And we kick off the second half as Harry plays the ball back to Trot, who plays the ball upfield. A free kick to Chenix as number 10 whips in a lofty free kick. The Chenix player there is not happy. We've managed to clear our lines by Sammy James, but number 10's creeping at the back post here as that ball is whipped in all the way to the back post. There's two of them queuing up to shoot. Number 10, he's only walked from taking a free kick to the back post with unmarked and he scores. Another free kick to Chenix. We're good at defending these as number 8 whips it, bends it around the wall and into the corner of the goal. 3-2 up at half time, 4-3 down. Here's another angle of that free kick. Good free kick. All that hard work undone. Oh goody, look, another free kick that we've managed to concede. Oh, it ain't a dangerous one as it's lofted in. They've put the ball in the back of the net, no marking. Offside, we've managed to get away with that one. For anyone that thinks I was picking on number nine, here he is dropping like a sack of shit yet again wonder why they got so many free kicks if there was ever a game plan it was to play four set pieces as number 10 lines up again knocks it wide this time they even go down in their own half as harry lines up with a shot it does seem like who's pandered to this ref with he who shouts loud is gets what they want ronnie in a one-on-one -on -one battle as he cuts inside the edge of the area he has a bend in shots don't forget we are looking for sponsors and so are our players I don't want to sponsor. Oh. made a couple of changes into the second half as vader gets on and tries a couple of little drag bags plays it back to Harry, plays it into Trotty, very congested in that box, we've got one man in the middle there. Against eight Northampton players, I've loft him pull into the air, nice feet by number nine as he peels off there, he's left his marker, ball's whipped into him, he's going for the shot. Rusev's just done enough to flick that away from him. There's not been a lot from us in this second half as we line up for a corner. Sammy James to whip that ball in. It's heading all the way to the back post where Vader is. Jumps like a starfish, defender beats him. Vader to collect this ball on his right hand side. Can he beat the defender? Defender's pulled in the tackle. The defender, he's, he's allowed that defender back in. He should never have done that. But hang on, is there a free kick? Nope, they've just all stopped. Every single one of them stopped. You play to the whistle. Simple ball by Flav who's allowed their player back into the game. Little drag back and off he goes. Nice and simple. We've managed to retain the ball. Sammy James plays the ball in all the way over to Ronnie. He's got a lot of work to do. As he drops his shoulder, he curls the ball. It's hit the bar. What's it? 
gold out of the bit. We've upped it in the last five minutes as Flav crosses a ball into a dangerous area. It is cleared semi. Sammy James plays the trotting. Trotty's looking to break them lines. He's put a lovely ball in through to Flav, but it looks like there's just a little too much on that and we don't get across it. And with Onion Head in the way, the ref has called full time. Lexworth Garden City Eagles 3, Northampton Owen Chinix 4. Can I give you feedback? 10 minutes or 2 goals? 2 goals after 10 minutes. Straight after half, Flav and Flav. In the first half, we go out, you can see 2 goals in 10 minutes against a team, which I didn't think was any good. 4 fucking goals. Everyone has standards defensively. Blow, throw you on the back, blow, tap it in. Individually, you have to ask yourself, did you fucking give 100% when it was fucking hard? I put you on there, Ray, to hold it up, we're going around the corners. This is where the character set. <laughs> this is about the bollocks. Oh yeah, fuck you, got beat. Fuck it. Oh yeah, we'll turn up next week. Fuck off. Means I have to work harder on personnel. Can't get changed. We are third game of the season. Unfortunately, it's another defeat for us. A 4-3 defeat. How do you think your performance was? How do you think the boys played? I think we could have played better. I think defensively, a little bit of lack of communication caused us a couple of problems against the Dutch. You didn't have the right mindset. You also scored, so now you're on the uh, score sheet. You've opened up your tally for the season. Take first your goal very well. Yeah, first place. Final result, Electric Garden City Eagles 3, Northampton on Chinix 4. It's another kit we've got to throw in the bin there. It was an entertaining first half. Three times we took the lead. Northampton just never gave up. And in the end, it paid off for them. And they've walked away with all three points. Never give up attitude. You can't fault that. Pick yourself up for the next game, which is away this Tuesday to Bitcoin. I mean, Real Bedford. You know what to do. Tyler. Bollocks, fuck it. Just one word. Oh, well, bollocks. Okay.